We need to talk about energy consumption. Energy prices today are at some of the highest prices ever, and yet our energy usage continues to go up year after year. One of the things I'm passionate about is finding ways to make my home more energy efficient to save myself money and minimize my impact on the environment. A few years ago, I did a video showing you guys how installing a Sense device helped me monitor my home's energy usage, but I've since moved, so I wanted to show you guys how I'm using the latest version of Sense in my new home. For those that haven't seen my previous video, Sense is an energy monitoring device that installs into your breaker panel that allows you to see how much power devices in your home are using. Sense now offers three different products. Sense, which is the base energy monitor system, Sense Solar, which allows you to utilize the device if you also have solar, and Sense Flex, which is what I'm using in my house now, which I'll dive into. What's cool about any of the Sense devices is that it starts to show you your exact energy usage in real time and starts to identify different devices around your home. The smart learning algorithm is continually improving and can determine many devices over time and starts to suggest a label for them automatically. You can verify or change the name of it right within the app, and as more homes connect to the app, it continues to learn and define devices. Once you have energy information, you can use that info to make more energy efficient improvements to your home and identify energy vampires around your home. Now, Sense always recommends that you have the device installed by a licensed electrician, which I'm not, but if you're comfortable working with your breaker panel, you can DIY it like me. Now, my home is a little different than most in that I actually have two 150 amp main service panels. So I'm not gonna dive too deep into the technical steps to install it in this video. Check out my previous video for a step-by-step -step walkthrough, which is more like a typical service panel on how to get it installed. But again, I'd like to remind you, if at any point you are not comfortable tackling this project on your own, please reach out to a licensed electrician that can help you with the installation. In this house, I'm using the Sense Flex device. The difference between Sense and Sense Flex is that Sense Flex allows you to do what's called dedicated circuit monitoring. For me, this is really beneficial because I just ran a sub panel out to my workshop, which is going to be the hub of my business. Having the dedicated circuit monitoring will allow me to not only forecast my energy usage for my business, but also allow me to separate my business from our personal energy consumption, which is extremely helpful for budgeting and for tax purposes. Now, if I didn't have the shop to monitor, this would still be a good device because I could focus solely on the circuit that charges our electric vehicle, so I could see exactly how much energy that is using as well and compare that to what the average gas prices are. Sense Flex comes with a second set of CTs or clips that you install around the wires of the specific circuit that you want to monitor. It clips onto the circuit the same way as the main CTs and starts to immediately identify devices through the app. Now I've looked on Amazon and there seems to be a fair amount of negative comments about the device's ability to identify devices, which I think is a little bit unfair because I've found it to be pretty accurate. It doesn't identify every single thing in your home and especially not right away. However, you can really drill down into it as much as you want by flipping switches around the house, unplugging and plugging things in, and watching your real-time energy reading. Once the device is found, make sure you go in and verify it by flipping the switch or unplugging it, and then you can make sure that it's getting the device correct. Another cool feature is the ability to set goals with notifications to keep your energy consumption down and see which devices are using the highest percentage of power. Now, I personally think a device like this can definitely be useful for the average homeowner and certainly for someone like myself who is always looking to improve my home's energy efficiency because I care about the environment and also because I'm really cheap. Now the Sense device is a diagnostic tool that can help you prioritize where you focus your home improvement efforts and help you save a substantial amount of money over time. So if you get a huge utility bill and you think that maybe your air conditioner is the culprit, well, you can go in the app and figure it out right away just by flipping on the air conditioning, watching the energy usage fluctuate in real time in the app and identify that it needs to be replaced or serviced. It's really that simple. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'd like to thank the Sense team for sending over the Sense Flex device. It's been extremely helpful for me, specifically because I get to kind of separate my business from my personal. And if you guys think the Sense Flex would be helpful for you as well, I'll leave more information on the Sense device as well as a link to where you can find it in the description down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if it's your first time visiting the channel, please hit that subscribe button and also hit that notification bell so you never miss out on any of the new content I put out. And as always, you can check out all of my DIY and home improvement related content on my website at mrfixitdiy.com. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time.